Yeah, 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 yeah. Energy, energy. Come and get that energy. Energy, energy. Come and get that energy. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It is the most amazing Saturday, my friend. But you got to feel it. You got to believe it. And you got to own it. And you got to come out here in the world and show it, my friend. See, this game, this life, you can't just talk it. You just can't hope it and wish it. You got to be it, my friend. So I challenge you to come out here today and be the change that you want to see in the world. Whatever you expect from anyone else, you demonstrate it, my friend. In other words, you show the world your expectations, how you want to be treated, how you want to be loved by how you treat and love other people, my friend. But if you want that ultimate, non-stop, super impact energy, it's right here. Yeah. And I got a great message for you today. A great message. This message goes out to everybody out there that's been grinding, that's been doing their best to manifest their goals, my friend. But it just seems like it's impossible. This message, my friend, is for you. This message goes out to everybody out there that the closer they get to achieving their goals, the further away they feel, right? Here's the thing. I don't care what's in front of you right now. I don't care how impossible it feels right now. You can't stop now. You can't stop now, you just can't. And here's why, right? Because that obstacle, that roadblock, that challenge is not as difficult as you think. See, that challenge is nothing more, right? Than a test. It's only a test to see if you really, really want it. And you gotta understand this, right? The easier the journey, the less appreciation you'll have for your arrival. So the challenge is necessary, it's preparing you to be able to, to fully receive what you want. Besides, that's not it. That's just not it, right? Here's the thing. You didn't start this journey out to stop it. You didn't come this far to only come this far. You know you didn't. Don't sit here and quit and then say, I knew I wasn't going to do it anyway because you thought you was going to do it the whole time. So just hang in there and get it done, right? And this may help. This may help. This may help. See, you got to stop allowing your external circumstances, right? To force you to change your goals. But instead, instead, right? Increase your desire to achieve your goals so that it forces you to change your circumstances, my friend. Never forget proactive people, they get what they want. But reactive people, well, they get whatever's left over, right? You want to be proactive, my friend. And here's three reasons why you got to keep going. You got to keep going. You got to keep going, right? Number one. You got to keep going because you're too powerful, right? You are so, so powerful, right? That's how powerful you are. You're so powerful that you can identify what you want in life and force life to actually give it to you. That's how powerful you are. That's how incredible your mind is. Your thoughts penetrate any surface, my friend. But you got to understand it. You got to accept it. You got to believe it. Then you got to come out here and you got to be it, my friend, right? And number two. This is what you gotta understand about limitations. You don't have any. The only limitations that you have, that you see in yourself, are the limitations that you placed on yourself, my friend, or the auto suggestions that you have accepted from someone else's life and said, me too. No, none of that is your truth, my friend. You gotta get back to your truth, which means you gotta reconnect to your source, to your maker, my friend. Anybody that wants to know how to operate a certain thing, they have to go back to the manufacturer, right? Because the manufacturer knows exactly the impact of the thing that they made. So if you want to understand your, your limitations and your lack thereof, you got to reconnect to God, my friend. That's the only way, right? And number three, you got to develop a greatness mindset, a mind bold enough to believe, right? Here's the thing. If you want to look at the cup half empty, then the world is going to seem like it's impossible. 
But if you're able to see clearly, if you're able to get the jealousy, the envy, the unforgiveness, all that out your life, so you don't have no gaps in your armor, and you can see clearly, that's when you'll see that the cup is half full, right? And life is truly indeed limitless, my friend. There are no limits to what you can do and how you can do it. You just got to strip down the falsehood that you've been taught from this world system and you got to reconnect with your source, my friend, with your manufacturer. And that is God, right? And never forget this. You were born to be great.